Hi everyone, it's Jason back to basics. I'd like to introduce Sandra today. She's come in for her first week consultation back and we've looked at a few things and what we've discovered is that from this week of eating to last week, there's been quite a substantial difference. Now, with her centimetres, she's had a really big centimetre loss and I asked her in relation to last week to this week, what was the biggest changes that she had? Now, she said that she used to snack between meals. Lots of snacks. Lots of snacks. Mm. And you were snacking mostly on? Oh, anything sweet, anything that was instant. Yep. Anything instant. So a lot of sugar. And yeah. what I think has happened to her previously is that sugar is an inflammation. So um, it inflames the body. So whilst we don't see an irritated bowel or inflammation on the inside, when we look at her centimetres coming down of her loss this week, She's taken two centimetres off a chest, four under a breast, three on the stomach and two on a bottom and coming down to thighs and um, the bottom, uh, yeah, her thighs as well as lost five centimetres. But she's also lost 3.5 kilos and that's in the week. So the reason why I asked how this week was to last week is that I pretty well know that it was a big changer and that her body was in an inflamed state. So next week those centimetres won't be high as high because the centimetres will still keep coming down and the weight will still keep coming down because we're recorrecting. But when someone has a huge drop in the first week, I know that long term you shouldn't really go back to the way you were eating previously because it wasn't agreeing with you. No. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, now, she has also commented that you're eating smaller meals. Mm. So that's working for you yes, as well? Yes, because you have to weigh meals. Uh, yep. And, and judge, well, judge to yeah. in a very good range. Uh, the right quantities yeah. to, to cook and to eat. And do you think that's been helpful? Because I think mm. a lot of people get confused on how much volume we should be eating, and we've yeah. got so used to supersizing or mm. eating everything that's on our plate. So when we do the back to basics, we try and give you an idea or a structure, especially in the beginning, to reteach mm. and re-educate people on how much food to eat. So did you find that that was quite surprising from mm. the way you were eating before to what we're doing today? Yes, it makes you stop and think and you think, oh, that was way too much food. Yeah. It really was. Yeah. So cutting it down to a palm size is Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Okay. Well, thanks, Sandra, for joining us today. And we'll keep tracking her results as we go through on the Back to Basics program mm -hmm. and um, see how she comes up at the end of five weeks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> thanks, everyone.